there everyone and welcome to my channel Hecate's Daughter. I'm your girl Azria and I never thought I would ever be making a video like this but there's something about foodie beauty that has given me the drive to want to get up in her ass for every video she makes from this point on. So I've always known um, well, not always, but after, let me just give you a brief history. So I was, a, I've been a part of girl world maybe for about a year and I got right into it through foodie beauty. So I came across her. I don't know how the fuck she was in my recommended. And I ended up liking her because, or even having a soft spot for her because I believe that she was being abused by Nader. Now Nader, N Nader is an abusive person. And so, and I've seen his attributes in my past relationship. So I thought that, oh, look at this poor girl. And she was giving off that like, guys, like I'm being gaslit, I'm being manipulated. So I had a soft spot for her. It didn't take me long. I paid for one month subscription and by the time I was into like my second day of my second month I was like I don't like this bitch there's something off about her I don't trust her there's certain things that she's saying I don't like her so I even remember saying in her chat like you can block me if you want but blah 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 I'm out right it was actually another account so I didn't like her from then. And that's when I started to see um, my Twitter feed and hear about all this stuff about her. But I never actually saw much of her content from way before. She's been on the internet since like 2017 or something like that, right? So I, I've i been invested in Girl World since then with Amberlynn Reed, et cetera. And I've been watching FFG. I watch Gaining Ground. I watch um, Alex is Shook, et cetera. And there is something about, like, even though I've learned that she's a liar and a manipulator and that she's made racist, bigoted, and anti-Semitic remarks, I know she fetishizes men of color, I know she neglected her animals, and I know she's a woman who moved to Kuwait and wears a hijab for a man, and she's lying when she says that she's actually a um, Muslim who converted to Islam, right? I, I know that. But there was something about this arc, about this I have diabetes arc. And then all of a sudden introducing a marketing, a multiple, was it called a multiple level marketing scheme that has just sent me so far over the edge with this girl that I have so many frustrated, like feelings of frustration and seeing how manipulative she is. And I find her to be actually predatory that I said, fuck it. I'm, I'm hopping on the hate train, y'all. So this is going to be my channel. And I really hope that in the future, I become one of those people that she's like, oh my God, Azria, she, she doesn't want to show her face. By the way, that is my face that you're looking at. Somebody drew me. But anyway, she doesn't want to show her face. And um, she wouldn't even have a career or have any money if it wasn't for my videos. If I leave, then you know, what would she be doing? Stay mad. I want to be one of those people that gets on her goddamn nerves. Okay. The way she gets on mine. So let's just get into the first video. I want to respond to the making my life better video. And I want to bring up some points that I think are valid. And then from now on, what I'm going to do is react to her videos because I got time girl, I'm self-employed. And then I'm going to go all the way back into the archives from the beginning so I could really get to know what everybody's saying. And not only am I going to do that, but I'm also going to be, so I, I'm licensed by the Law Society. Actually, my license, I, I didn't like upkeep my license, but I went to school to be a paralegal. And I also, um, I took my licensing exam. I worked in the legal field for what? 2009 to 2019. So that's what, 20 years. And is that 20 years or 10 years? Wait, 2007. I went to school, graduated 2009 to seven, whatever. I, I suck at math, but basically I got licensed in 2017. I've been in the industry since 2009 and I have a very like a way of looking at things where I really want to, when I call this girl out for being a liar, that I have facts. So I'm going to be, when I do watch her older videos, I'll just have a little spreadsheet on the side that you guys, I'll show you every so often. That's going to be like, you know what, November 14th, 2023 at eight o'clock on this video, she said this. Oh, and then on the 14th, she said this. Did I just say the dates backwards? Whatever. But you know what I'm saying, right? I want to actually call her out. I'm going to have timestamps. I want to really expose this woman because I find that her new crowd She's she's drawing in a new group of people. And I think that's why she's really pushing pro-Palestine so much. Because, I mean, let's be real. The girl's a bigot. She doesn't care about Palestine, right? But I think there's a reason why her TikTok is so Muslim-oriented, pro-Palestine. And it's because she wants to draw that new, forgiving, uneducated crowd about who she really is over to her channel. So that she can friggin' 
like profit off them and push MLM shit onto them. So nah, this she got me fucked up now. Now I, I'm I'm no, nah. she's literally a predator to me. Um, she's engaging in predatory behaviors, and I'm calling it out. So let's just get into the video because I'm starting to sweat. This girl's irritating, and I've been rambling for five minutes now. Okay. <laughs> Hello, booty beauties. <laughs> ho, ho, ho. The holiday season, and what better gift to give someone you love than a personal video from me they can keep forever and ever. Get yours now. And yes, I am Muslim, but I- Oh my gosh. Like, who, have you ever seen anyone who claims to be Islamic promote something that had to do anything to do with Christmas? Like, she will literally do anything for money. Oh, and oh, I, oh by the way, yes, I, I know I say I'm Muslim, but you know what? I could still wish you a happy holiday. Like, what the? <laughs> she has lost her fucking mind. But I can still wish you a happy ho ho holiday. Can you get me okay? It was a little over 21 years ago that I actually joined the company as a franchise partner. The reason I chose this company was because there was... I know this is super fast, but like, who wants to hear this guy? I, I, let's just get, let's get past this. Okay. Hello, it's lovely. Welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to be talking about some products I am going to be trying out. So, we're going to try this together. I don't know if I'm the, does she, is, how, where does she get this music from for the, the background? I'm so yeah, damn sick and tired of hearing the same song. I can tell it's her favorite, and I I don't know. Just use something else, girl, please. I told you I've been looking for some supplements, so I am going to make the first one I'm going to take right now. And it's something I've been looking for to increase my energy because I do have, I don't talk about this a lot, but I have chronic fatigue where... Okay, right off the bat, she's bullshitting, okay? When did you say you were looking for supplements? And if you did say it, it was in line with knowing that you were about to drop an MLL, an MLM onto people, this unicity crap. Oh, I have chronic fatigue. Well, maybe if you didn't eat 42 bags of chocolate bars and have diabetes and not exercise and not go for any walks and not sleep all day, would you, maybe you would, it's not chronic fucking, the, you're, you're just lazy. You're causing your own tiredness. But now she's all of a sudden been looking for supplements, y'all. I could have sworn she said the doctor put her on a second medication. I don't recall anything about looking for supplements, but okay, Chantel. Where I can spend hours and hours and hours sleeping in bed. And I just feel like I said before, moving through quicksand, I don't have energy. So, so I'm going to be trying first thing, this Unicity Unimate and it's Yerba Mate. I'm going to be pausing this. Okay, so this doesn't make sense. So she said she was looking for supplements, right? But then she also said she had a seminar to go to. So is she trying to say that she just happened? Guys, I was just looking for supplements because you know I have chronic fatigue. And then I came across Unicity. And then I was like, you know what? Even though I'm looking for supplements, instead of me trying to find somebody who would just, I would just buy it because they just sell it on Amazon. What I'll do instead is try to make money and profit, even though... I have not tried this fucking thing for more than two days, three days. She hasn't been on the thing. I don't think she, she maybe even tried it at the seminar, but she's not been actively taking this. formula. It's their own patented, for, patented formula. And uh, here's the ingredients. Yerba mate leaf extract, erythritol. Um, basically the, the sweeteners are erythritol, um, Reb A, stevia extract, and sucralose. So let's give this a little try here. So I already put cold water <laughs> and it comes with... You know what's kind of crazy? You can tell that all the ingredients that she just read, she doesn't have a clue what they are, what their functions are, how they work with the body. She's just reading it off the pack of the box, who, which she just opened. Did she just open this box? Hold on. No, the box is already open. So she's just reading the side of this box, which I believe she opened that day. <laughs> I could be wrong. These are just, you know, assumptions. And she's got, she's diabetic and she's on medication and she's just, you know, reading off a, a whole side of, of bullshit. She doesn't know what it does. With a, a diamond bottle here like this. And what I like about this bottle right off the bat is that it has um, water level that you need to put. So for the Unimate, this is how much water I'm putting, cold water. You can have the Mate, um, warm with milk you can use a frother you can put whatever you want in it uh or i drink mine cold so because i heard when it's cold it tastes like you know like a lemon iced tea or something so um you know what i'm just keep thinking about why she's rambling and talking the most amount of shit in my ear 
I keep thinking like you sat there on the couch and you were like, we're going to be doing some projects. We have a seminar to go to. And it, the projects is scamming your audience. That's the projects. You and Sala sat down. Project number one, we're going to get these dumb, beezing ass, trusting ass, don't know who I really am asses to just invest in this MLM. And they're going to make us rich, honey. Okay, I think Salah might have been like, listen, honey, you know why the fuck you're here. Okay, you're supposed to be getting that guap. And the fact that nobody's watching your shit anymore and FFG probably gets about five times the amount of views that you do, five times the amount of super chat, I'm done with it. You better find a way to make us some fucking money. <laughs> uh, um, let's go. Let's give it a good shake. You need to, to shake these products. That's why they give you the shaker bottle. I'm gonna shake it till everything's dissolved heard for like a good at least 20 to 30 seconds hey you're getting an arm workout all right so now i'm going to pour it into this cup here this real leather cup i love the smell of leather <laughs> very expensive leather crafted cup the inside is made of coconut yo did you guys uh, sorry i'm talking to you guys like you're my home girls like yo yo bitch <laughs> but did you guys see on twitter the timu cup this is the thing about girl world you are not to be fucked with she cannot do anything <laughs> without y'all just calling her out um honey this cup was on team move for seven dollars like but but you know what then again she might think that cup is very expensive that an eight dollar cup might be expensive would i spend eight dollars on a cup probably not so I, I you know what i'm not gonna i'm not gonna disagree with her there maybe she thinks that's expensive all right that is sold separate it's not for the company so all right so let's uh try it how is that Oh, a straw. So you see what's super weird about this is that she is promoting a supplement that she claims she's behaving as if it's benefiting her, right? But then outside of her ass, out of the, I mean, sorry, the corner of her mouth, sorry, my bad. She says, uh, let's try it. And it's, you could tell it's the first time she's tried it. Look at where I paused it. Does that, is that not the face of a woman who's about to scam the shit out of her audience? Come on. Tell me that's not the face of a liar. Let's, let's be real here. But anyway, I digress. So then she says, oh, let's try it. Takes a sip like she's never sipped on it in her whole life. Okay. And <laughs> how are you promoting this supplement then? How do you know it's going to make your life better? How, you don't know anything. Wow. I was expecting it to be like really sweet because of all the sweeteners and I don't love sweeteners. You know me, but I don't actually really taste them. It tastes uh, like, like a diet lemon iced tea, but like not as diety, not as sweet, like a lemon iced tea, basically like exactly like the Lipton. I'm, I'm telling you. Um, wow. Yeah, right. I think they have a mint and a lemon flavor. I went with the lemon. So the health. I, I cannot get over the level of ignorance in this whole video so far. We're only four minutes in. And she, the way that she has the audacity to bring a product to the internet and not even be testing it on herself. It's crazy to me. Oh, I think they have two flavors. Uh, let's try it, guys. Uh, these are the ingredients. Let me check the side of the box here. Never read it before. I don't know what the fuck's in it. Okay. Yeah. So anyway, guys, like what? health benefits of yerba mate um basically what i was told is um it's it's a caffeine drink so if you're sensitive to caffeine you know might not be for you but what i like about this is apparently what what is she talking about she was told what do you mean you were told buddy this is something i hope you guys didn't hear that that's my i hooked up my phone to my macbook and now when i get a message it's coming through but what is she talking about she was told what do you mean you were told? You're putting this into your body. You claim that you're sick or you are sick. You have diabetes, which you knew you had anyway, but I digress. And, oh, I was told that it has caffeine. Well, why don't you look at the fucking label that you just read out to everybody and double check? What do you mean you were told? Did you not see caffeine as an ingredient there? It should be on the box that you just read. You were told. So you're just going to just, anybody could just tell you, hey, take this. This, this is good for you. Um, it has this, 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 this. And then come to the internet and be like, guys, so I heard on the street, word on the street is that this supplement that's supposed to change my life, well, it's got caffeine. Do your research. What are you talking about? Apparently it, it gives you the caffeine effect, it, but it makes you more alert and there's no caffeine crash after. 
So basically, you don't get the jitters like you would with caffeine, okay? And you know me, I don't like, I'm looking for a good caffeine product to have once a day, and uh, which is perfect to give you a 30-day supply. And something that's not high in calories, and me, I can't drink coffee plain, I've tried it. I've tried the Americanos, but for me, I love something with flavor and a little bit of sweetness, not too sweet. So this is actually um, not too sweet at all. And oh, get, get out of here. Are you saying that everything that you say you're looking for in a caffeinated beverage, that supplement fits the bill? Well, I am fucking shocked. <laughs> oh my God, uh, what a fucking coincidence. And the lemon flavor is really, really yummy. It tastes natural. And I think there is natural flavor in there. So um, yeah, so far actually, and I'm going to give you guys like an honest review as I'm using these products because for me, even I don't do, I get tons of emails. You don't need, you know, what's funny. If you say you're going to give a review, you don't usually have to put that you're going to be honest. That should just be something that is um, presumed that is just a fact. It's not like, okay, guys, so today you're going to get an honest review. Normally, when I do reviews, I'm lying out of my ass. But today, today is the day of honesty. No, you're not. You're a liar. I get, you know, offers to review products and to do sponsorships. And, you know, I've ended sponsorships because I didn't like the direction they were going. Um, like once. yeah, exactly. <laughs> um, let me guess. I'm I, something tells what, what sponsorship is she talking about? I don't know. See, this is why I'm going to be going back through her past videos. I found this website that archived literally every video she's ever made and I'll be picking and choosing what I go through. So if you don't know anything about this girl, besides what's been going on for the last year, come on this ride with me. Let's go on together. But, um, as far as I know, she had like a clothing deal and the brand pulled out and I don't know anything else, but whatever. I'm not going to argue with somebody if I don't know. So I'm like very honest with, I, I, I am a person who loses interest in projects very quickly. So for me, if I'm not like passionate about something, uh, if I don't. The only project you lose interest in is ones that require hard work. This project, the one that you sat down with Salah, like I said, and decide you're about to scam the internet. Is not one you'll give up on. Well, actually, you will when you realize nobody is going to buy this shit. That your Beezers might not be as stupid as I think they are, is what I'm hoping. And that I'm pretty sure I saw on the internet that people were already reaching out to Unicity about you lying about their product, girl. You're about to get into a lawsuit. If I don't like something, you're going to know it. So your mate is very healthy. It has like, um, you know, herbal tea properties. It's, a, it's an herbal tea and it has like polyphenols, um, antioxidants, trace of... Sorry, guys. Sorry about that interruption. It's amounts of vitamins B6. It's been shown to lower cholesterol, um, help with blood sugar, digestion, alertness, without any of that crashing from the regular caffeine you would take. So that's what I'm excited <laughs> Listen, about. It's like she, she's such a liar, okay? She sounds like someone who's trying to sound like somebody who's on an infomercial. This, there's nothing that's genuine about her persona right now. And where has it been shown to lower cholesterol? And I, this is where I really feel like this entire like, oh, look at my blood. I'm showing you guys my medical information. You can see my blood sugar. And the doctor's putting me on another medication. This is why she did all of this. It's for her to come back now and say, guys, guess what? I'm feeling great. But watch, you're not going to see another blood sugar reading, right? You're not going to see her lose any weight. And you're not going to see her go back to the doctor to show her her details. All you're going to see is her drinking this shit for two minutes on camera and then coming back and saying, guys, I have so much energy. Like my life has changed. Look, remember I was crying on video the other day saying I had no joy in my life and all I cared about was food and that I need to find a therapist and I was going back to Canada. Well, guess Guess what? You in the city changed it all. If you want to change your life, please hit me up below. Like, I already see it. She's so, she thinks she's so smart, but she's really an idiot. I have to try it. I love iced tea, so. Very yummy. And you get quite a bit. Don't mind if I do. So far, I really like this. I'll see how it helps my energy levels already. Like, from the caffeine. I don't know. Like, it must have enough caffeine in it because I feel... What you, oh girl, oh, what you mean it must have enough? I still can't get over this. You know what? I was told that it had caffeine in it and I don't know how much caffeine, even though I read the side of the box a couple minutes ago and I was talking about all the ingredients and I didn't see caffeine there. Um, I'm going to just say it has caffeine. And you know what? Even though I just drank like about four and a half sips within about four minutes, God, if I, it feels like I just hit the crack pipe. I'm just so alert right now. You know? 
work. Oh my god. No, but how many? A few moments. Nothing's gonna stop us now. I feel hyper, and you're gonna get it. All right, <laughs> guys, look at me. I'm so quirky and funny, and like, isn't this such a drastic change from the way I wanted to almost like unalive myself the other day? Well, look at me now. I'm singing 80s songs. I'm sipping on my caffeine drink, even though I don't know if it has caffeine or not. And I'm just like, my life is changing literally right before your eyes. It's been seven minutes and 19 seconds, and my life has changed. Please buy this product, please. We'll come back. So that's not the only thing I have from Unicity, okay? I also purchased um, another product. Now it comes what? as a kit. They have so I want to know how much Unicity just got her for. How much Unicity just took her money, the 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 bare the little bit of money that she's making. How much did they scam you for? Huh? How much are you trying to scam everyone else to get back your money that you got scammed for? This is hilarious. I love it. I love it. A scammer getting scammed. I mean, it's called karma. Is that what you call it? So many different supplements. I talked to people salon. I went and met with other people who use a lot of products, female success stories of certain things. Basically, everything is all organic. Um, there's been no, re you know, reported side effects, negative side effects. And you can even look it up yourself. I've only seen really good things usually about this. Oh, we'll um, be looking it up, all right. So it's actually very popular here in the Middle East. And um, there's a lot of different TikTok accounts that promote it. And basically, so they have different health packages, whatever you're looking for. Um, See, is this where this all stemmed from? Was she just scrolling on TikTok one day and saw Unicity and thought, ooh, I can scam my followers with this? Or is this have to do with Salah? I don't know, because I heard somebody mention in FFG's chat when I was watching her video that um, Salah's sister might have something to do with it. I mean, none of, this, none of this really matters. I'm just curious, you know, is she that dumb that she got played by TikTok? One lady I spoke to, very nice Kuwaiti lady, she healed her asthma with this um, herbal remedy that she purchased. from. Where? I want to see receipts. The Kuwaiti lady in your head, that one, the one that you that lies to you and tells you that you're actually Islamic, that one? What Kuwaiti lady? Huh? From here, so I might look into that as well. She literally had bad asthma since childhood, and she she swears to me she has not used a puffer in a while. Now, it you know it took a bit of time for her to get to that point in using the product every day, but eventually she just no, started she noticing. Like, did this woman really just she she re she really just told her subscribers, okay, that this caffeine drink or what, what is this the drink that she's talking about yeah the caffeine drink with the sweeteners in it right has cured somebody's asthma or at least improved it because she hasn't had to use a puffer for a while even though there could be if she's telling the truth about this because i don't believe this woman even exists right but let's just say she's telling the truth about this how do you know that it was unicity that helped her with her asthma she could have made a million other life changes and unicity has absolutely nothing to do with it unless you have a study that's been done by scientists you should not be making statements like this Chantel. I don't, I forgot to take my puffer and I don't feel like I need it, you know? So I would love that because right now I can't even breathe. <laughs> so I got the package. It's Right. You can't breathe. So why the hell have you been blabbing on about complete and utter bullshit for eight minutes and 45? Usually when people can't breathe, they don't sit there talking the most amount of garbage. They usually save their breath. You can breathe just fine. It's, it's she's a horrible, she's a horrible salesman. Horrible. It's called the feel good package. And it comes with the Unimate and something called Slim. And Slim... Is oh, it's called the Feel Great Package. But she, <laughs> she <laughs> you can remember great and good, huh? That's your only job. Oh, damn it, Chantel. Really? You had fucking three words. Feel, three words. Feel Great Package. And she messed up the second one. Is a patented product from Unicity. Now, all of their products um, are FDA approved and are part of the... I have to put it here because I can't remember everything. I just started. Chantel, they, they are not FDA approved. Do people, do, do I, I wonder if the world really, well, the world, the girl world understands how serious this statement that she just made is. I don't even think this is legal. I think this is illegal to promote a product, to say that it cures you, all right, cures health ailments, not know the ingredients, make up stories that somebody has benefited from it medically without any medical proof, and then has the nerve to say that it's approved by the FDA.
Well, I, I'm going to slip a screenshot into this because I want to show you guys at the end. Because it's not the only time she says it's FDA approved, by the way, okay? She says it more than once in this video. Started this using this. But basically, um, you know, I went to um, a seminar with Salah and we, were, we learned because Salah has a lot of friends who recommended this whenever he, you know, whenever we talked about like my health issues and stuff. So, and then I was looking for something and... Um, Is that a Starbucks? It, that, that looks like a Starbucks drink in her hand while she's sitting on the couch. No, I'm gonna have to go back. Just, just, just go back just a little bit. Is that not a Starbucks drink in her hand? Maybe not, but it looks like it. Okay, pro Palestine. So I okay, about, you know a lot about the product, but I'm still learning, right? So, but basically, this is the Slim, and this is a month supply. So it's for you. You would take one packet twice a day before meals. Uh, and then once you take it, you wait 15 minutes and then eat your meal. And this is Bios Life, their patented um, formula. Uh, again, FDA approved. And it has a whole... She has no idea what she's talking about. She can barely get the words out of her mouth, the, the nonsense that she's talking. She's just regurgitating what someone told her. This is how you sell. When she says that she's been going to a seminar, I was like wondering, what seminar could you possibly be going to? It, it's all coming to a head now it's all making sense to me now because she wouldn't ever do anything that didn't have to be to do with making money being manipulative self-absorbed blind taking advantage of people but it's just kind of crazy to me that she had the audacity to call this a seminar girl you got you got you got got <laughs> you got got that's what you did whole bunch of vitamins um vitamin a vitamin c vitamin e thiamin riboflavin niacin b6 folate b12 biotin calcium zinc chromium sodium potassium and it's um has yeah okay and what's the percentage of all these vitamins you know how it says a serving per serving on the when you look at ingredients and it'll say 10 percent, 0.5 percent how what is this that we're ser what in, especially in comparison to the sweetener you haven't given any of that information you're just trying to just throw everything out there that sounds good to the ear that doesn't even make sense and so far i still have not heard this girl say that she's been reading the word caffeine on that box has a lot of uh, fiber yeah so let me tell you what it, what it does so this is what it looks like you get like a one month supply and each package is like this okay i'm gonna add the water to my thing here which still has a bit of residue from my my unimate this is Chantel, I, I know that you you definitely think that your audience are a bunch of buffoons because why would they be following you or believing anything that you say? But they don't need you to show them how to pour water into a plastic container and put a packet in. Can you speed this up? This is how much water you add for the balance. You want to drink it within 10 minutes. And it's you can add milk. Um, or... You can drink it with water. I drink mine with water. Okay. Oh my God. And you want to drink it, yeah, within 10 minutes, then wait 15 minutes and then eat your meal. Because of the fiber level, the idea is that it slow, slows the absorb absorption of glucose into your system. And the Slim product is the main goal. I need to... Let's let's just look this up real quick, okay? I need to know about this. Actually, you know what? Let's, let's give her another 10 seconds before we do a little bit of research is to um reduce insulin resistance okay to help with insulin let's resistance let's let's without balance Fuck. without balance <laughs> why does she just have a chart that's called without balance in on the what, what does that mean okay anyway so insulin levels blood sugar with oh okay without if they're saying without the packet Carbohydrate foods bring your insulin level and blood sugar all the way up. And then insulin levels, what? This time after eating. There, buddy, there's no numbers here. She's got time after eating, but there's no times on the chart. Okay. Insulin levels. She's got an arrow. <laughs> but she ain't got no levels. <laughs> I hope to God that this woman just hopped on like the word on her Mac or fucking windows, whatever the hell, and just made this because if this is what was made by the company and handed out, we have a problem here. Normal blood sugar levels, the, right? The green dashes, we see them. 
what <laughs> I'm sorry. Anyone can just draw a graph and have the levels and the blood sugar go all the way up and then go all the way down. What are the what are the fucking numbers? Well, you can't put numbers because that people to actually say, like, listen, we want to see medical proof of this, right? We're just gonna she, she I <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Let me just hit play. This bitch is crazy. And prevent, you know, health prevent diabetes. Um, so even on the package here, make life better. So that's one of the things I really liked about the company and why I decided to purchase with them and try it out is because that logo, make life better. And if, you know, they talked about this in the seminar, like, you okay. know, a company has a responsibility. So this woman basically just said she was basically near death. She was sitting there a couple days before this video saying she doesn't know what she's going to do. She feels like life isn't worth living. She's very, very scared about her health. And she decides to go with a supplement that's supposed to help her with her diabetes and heal all her ailments. And it's because I like the logo, guys. I like the logo. But yet she's scared of the medication and all the side effects, but she goes with a company that ain't got no numbers for their, for their charts. <laughs> like she, Oh, I was told it has caffeine, even though caffeine isn't on the box. I was just told that this is the company. This is what she decides to take as medication y'all. In addition to the medication she's on, not knowing how the two work. I mean, she's, do you, do you guys really think she's going to be drinking this? Cause I really feel like she's about to put that box down and wait for the next person to hit her up and be like, Hey, can you sell me the box so I can try to sell it? And she's going to take the same box that she just opened up and give it to the next person. She will not be drinking the supplement unless she's on camera. I promise you. Responsibility to its clients, to its customers. And if you make, a, especially if you make a product where you are trying to fix a global problem and we have a global health crisis right now, which is, insulin resistance or diabetes and i mean this couldn't come at a better time for me because i'm literally yeah right right this couldn't be guys this literally is like magic it's magic it's actually my karma for being such a wonderful muslim woman that right at the point where even though i already knew i had diabetes but right when i you know confirm that i have diabetes and even though i know there are certain actions that i need to take in my life that would actually help um make all my in issues lessened instead god has brought forth allah has put forth in my life balance okay feel great supplements fuck all the hard work okay fuck it let's just let's just drink some random products guys and this is god this god has brought this to me and i'm bringing it to you god has brought this to me god is bringing me to you to bring this to you too to make me money it's it's all god it's all it's just that it's just like i mean wow wow I can combine with my medication safely. This is all natural, organic, nothing, no chemical or anything like that. Um, and I like like that they actually care about their clients. They're there for you 24, like they're, they're well, I don't know about 24 seven, but you have contact with them through uh, WhatsApp. You can, you know, they're always there to help you. It's like a team thing. You feel like you're part of something. I'm just here to try the products. What? Okay, first of all, this is very concerning to me. If I buy a product that's supposed to be helping me with my health and change my life for the better, why the fuck would I need to be calling customer service every minute? That doesn't make sense. That sounds like I'd be having problems. Or she's she has a she's on a team because the team is an MLM, right? And they're trying to make money. That's why she would have to be contacting them. So when she says, mm -hmm. I'm just here to try the products, guys. <laughs> I'm just here to try the products. It's nothing to do with the fact that I'm going to try to push this on you after I pretend that my life is improved, right? Then you're going to ask me and I'm going to say, just get it for me, guys. Just get it for me. Or she's going to pull out the code. If you decide to go with this product, use my code below. One of, one of two things are happening here, but please do not act as if you have customer service. It's called your employer, okay? Your coach, that's what you mean? and um see how they work for me you know before anything else <laughs> give it a good shake now to me i'm gonna be honest with you guys always when i first you're not, you're not honest. Okay. So listen, you see how she said, I'm going to be honest with you guys always. This is the second time that she's made a point to say that she's being honest. 
And I know this is because if you look back at her last two videos, she kept saying, and I was wondering like, why does she keep saying this? She kept going, guys, I don't want to just keep coming on and like being dishonest with you guys and just like trying to show only when I'm happy. I want to be honest with you guys and also show you the sad parts of my life when I'm not feeling good. I'm, I'm not saying it's not word for word verbatim, but that's pretty much what she said, right? This is what she did on purpose so that now she can come back and be like, guys, you know, I'm always honest with you, right? Because, you know, two days ago I said I was being honest, you know, I didn't have to come on there and cry and say my life sucked. I was being honest. So, you know, now if I was being honest, then I'm being honest right now. Scam, manipulation tool, horrible, horrible human right here. I'm sorry. I first tried this. My knee jerk reaction was. What am I drinking? It, it, you know what else is crazy to me? How can you sit there and say, guys, I'm going to be honest with you always when there are a multitude of videos where you have admitted to lying to your audience? Like, is this this is what we call an attempt to gaslight. She's not gaslighting me because I can see right through her. But she's literally trying to change somebody else's reality just by saying, God, you know, I'm honest with you always. Even though I say I lie sometimes, I'm honest with you always. You know why? Because a lie, when it comes from me, a lie isn't really a lie, okay? So what had happened was, <laughs> girl. This is weird. It's it's a bit sweeter than the Unimate, but it tastes like, um, kind of like an orange creamsicle. It's an orange flavor, creamy orange flavor, but it's thick because it has like old fiber and different fibers in it. So, you know, what? I don't even know what the fuck that said. And I, I started reading it and I'm like, you know what? Let's just go back and look at it. OK, so the health benefits outweigh the taste. Some benefits include reduces carbohydrate impact on the body. The special blend of soluble fibers in balance helps to slow the rate of glucose absorption into the body, helping you to maintain steadier, more consistent energy levels throughout the day and preventing energy spikes and crashes that often happen after we eat. Where does she get this from? Is this on the website? Now, I'm going to have to do some research after this, y'all. Orange creamsicle. It's an orange flavor, creamy orange flavor, but it's thick because it has like old fiber and different fibers in it. So all the ingredients are on the box as well, but it does. It does have fiber, so it's a thick, it's like a thickened liquid, you know, but when I tried it before lunch. That shaking is driving me nuts. Also, another thing, guys, is where does she get that little snippet of information from? Because it looks like she just pulled something off the internet and then stuck a picture of the balance logo inside of the, of the, um, that looks like a Google screenshot. Like, you know, when you just type in Google and then she looks like she just highlighted some information and then just stuck the picture on there. I don't think that's on their website. Um, I was full. Like, I was like, oh, I feel full, you know, like uh, not too, too full and comfortable, but I felt like a level of fullness where I didn't have um, such a large capacity to eat all of my meal. And now I'm going to eat my dinner. Duh. She's going to have anybody. You don't have to drink unicity for you to feel full after drinking a bottle of powdered juice and then having to eat. I, did she not say you have to eat 10 minutes after or something like that? Like you have to eat after you drink it. Obviously, if you guzzle down. Oh, she said you have to drink that bottle within 10 minutes. So clearly, if you have to drink all of that by a certain amount of time, you're probably not going to be hungry right after for your dinner. It's just common sense. It has nothing to do with unicity. So I'm going to drink this and then wait 15 minutes, eat my dinner. This actually dissolved very okay. nicely. Um, so yeah, when I first tried it. There you go. So you have to drink that all that liquid, that powdery liquid within a 10 minute time span. And then she's going to eat dinner 15 minutes and be like, guys, that was so full. Like, oh, yeah, I don't know why. It could be because my stomach is full of liquid. <laughs> that can never be it. It has to be unicity. And then when I kept drinking it, it was okay. That's, you know, it just... It's like Buckley's. It might not taste the best, but it works. You might actually love the flavor. Um, like Buckley's. It smells nice, but it's, you know. <laughs> it smells nice, but it's not a chocolate bar. I get it. I get it. Not as bad. She hates it. When I first it. tried it, I just didn't know what to expect. It was thick. It was kind of weird. But now, Ew. it's not bad. It's like a more liquidy... Look at, look at that lion. Look at that. I always seem to catch her on her lion ass face. Look at that laugh. That face is just a whole laugh. But you know what she just said? She just even said too, that it's thick. It's a thick product and it looks thick. It actually, it's quite disgusting. 
look how long she had to shake it for it to dissolve too. There's nothing appealing about this product at all. Never even heard of it. Yet it cures asthma and diabetes, y'all, but I ain't never heard of it. I should I, I would have given my grandpa if I had known about this. Not FDA approved, guys, but it cures diabetes and, and asthma. But anyway, I digress. So she's trying to tell you guys that having a thick liquid ingested in 10 minute time span and then eating your dinner 15 minutes later is not is nothing to do with with. <laughs> Oh my God, I can't with her. Diet orange creamsicle milkshake or something. <laughs> if you add milk, it might actually taste like a milkshake. I don't know. You oh, probably milkshake. blend it with like a bit of ice with milk. Make it like a smoothie. You could probably do that. Right. Make it like a smoothie and then go sit down and eat your dinner 15 minutes later and then say, hey guys, I'm not hungry because unicity works. Or could it be because like I keep repeating myself, but the stupidity is, is so next level. I'm actually would be shocked if anybody actually bought this from her now i was trolling her comment section because that's what i do because sometimes i'm like i'd be telling people like you're dumb like what, what are you saying on this girl's comment like are you, you really falling for this shit that's me and i saw an account that was like hey guys i really think i might get this product because blah 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 and then of course i clicked on it and it was like you've been a, it, oh even salah had answered the person actually and i was like there's no way that this person is real Th this, there's no way clicked on the account and they had only been an, uh, on youtube for like two months or something like that so clearly that's fucking a sock account right so how i think this will benefit me personally well um it supposedly helps with the insulin resistance so we'll see about that over Really, it's supposed if if you don't how you think it will benefit you and it supposedly helps. Why are you taking something you don't know what it's going to do to you and then trying to push it onto other people? Because we already know this is the ultimate goal here, right? She is going to pretend that she is a. I'm going to give you guys my testimony. It has been 47 minutes since I drank, and I'm telling you right now, this Unicity has changed my life. This is this is what's coming next. I'm pretty sure. Over time. Um... But honestly, drinking this uh, to add fiber to my diet and to just make me feel fuller so I'm not eating as much because I have a very, very, very big appetite, especially lately. I don't know what it is, but it's like on double mode. Like it's just like on turbo mode. Like I'm always just so hungry. So when I eat, I've been eating, you know, larger quantities. <laughs> this woman has not dropped even a inch of fat from around her face okay she's not not even water retention she is exactly 166 kilograms nothing has changed and now she's like guys i don't know what it is but i'm just so hungry well girl you eat even when you're not hungry i've seen you scarf down two sandwiches and you looked very uncomfortably full before the second sandwich and you ate it anyway so are you trying to say that you've been eating even more than what you've normally been eating but then you came on and said guys look at my carrots and my cottage cheese guys look as if that's all you've been picking on for the day. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, look at my little side portion of my container that has like little little strip of chicken. Because uh, you make up your mind. Which one is it? Have you not been eating? Have you been eating? Do you not know why your glucose levels are so high? Or do you know? I used to feel more satiated, which is not good, right? Especially on the pills I'm on. The, the pills I have have a lot of side effects. So if somehow this could um help me reduce the amount of medication i need in the long run somehow that would be awesome i don't know but because i still am struggling with the side effects of the metformin um but this apparently has no side effects so we'll see it's all natural organic stuff again approved by fda and oh yeah, again so i'm gonna uh... no that's it guys i need to know right now why is my computer's moving so slow i'm gonna is it illegal is it illegal to claim FDA approval. Okay, what claim requires FDA approval, y'all? All health claims, whether authorized or qualified, require pre-market review by the FDA. Under federal law, the FDA approves by regulation authorized health claims for use in food labeling only if the substance disease relationship described by the health claim meets the significant scientific agreement standard. All right? This is what the FDA says. And she's sitting over there talking about FDA approval, FDA approval. But you know what? I don't know. I don't know if this is going to work. I don't know if this is going to work for asthma or work for diabetes. We're just going to have to see. She's literally breaking the law right now on her platform. Drink this up. Uh, and then I'm going to have my dinner. And uh, so I'll see you guys for that because I want to talk about some things. But if you do want to try it, uh, I do have a referral code, a link in the description where you can get 30% off.
code, but oh, there, there it is, guys. There it is. Now I ain't got to be psychic. I just have to have common sense. Here she could look at lion ass face. <laughs> and by the way, she has not added anywhere. Has she added that she was gonna get paid through this? I, I don't know if I saw this, but anyway. Like, you really think that we didn't figure this? She didn't even wait until the next video where she can actually make claims that it benefits her. So, guys, if you've listened to me say that I don't really know the ingredients, that I don't really know if this works, but you trust me because I've been saying pro Palestine, please purchase this product with my referral code. Um, but this is this is what it was all about, y'all. This is what it was all about. This was all manipulation, all bullshit, all of it. This whole, ever since she said, I have diabetes, she has been, this is where she knew she was going. Um, you can also uh, message me um, through my link tree. I have my links for my TikTok. I might set up another way for you guys to message me, but if you want to uh, message me personally, I will be keeping my DMs open on TikTok and I, I will be watching them frequently because, you know, if you guys have any questions. Because, because I want to make money off y'all motherfuckers, that's why. Normally, I don't check my, my messages. I don't really give a shit about what any of you guys have to say. But today, today, we, we, I, I care about everything. But, uh, but if it has anything not to do with Unicity though, I don't really give a shit. But let me make that clear. But if it has to do with Unicity and you guys using my affiliate code and you guys giving me your money, I am keeping my DMs open. They'll be open on Instagram. They'll be open on TikTok. Bugger. You know what? They'll even be open on Cameo. They'll, my emails will be open. My comment section will be open. Even though I said the other day, I'm turning my comment section off. All of a sudden it's open. Why? Because I need to use my sock puppet accounts within the comment section to pretend that I'm actually going to buy the product for myself. Okay. So everything's going to be open. Don't worry. Questions. I have a team of people who can help me answer them for you since I'm new to this. Um, uh, so yeah. I, uh, what, did, what did she just say? Did she just say she has a team of people? You don't have a team of people. Those are what we call your employers, okay? This is a pyramid scheme. You are at the bottom of the pyramid. You are not even at the bottom. You are underneath the pyramid. Like, if you go to Egypt and go to a pyramid, you can actually go down below into what's called, I think it's called the, the can, the, something with a C. I can't remember. But that's where she is. No, she's not even there. She's actually under that when it comes to the pyramid scheme, okay? She's under the dirt, that's under the dirt, that's under the dirt. That's how little money she's about to make off this. And she has the nerve to call the people above her, her team. <laughs> Honey, that, that's your employer, that's your coach. That's not your, your, that's not a team. That's what they tell you to make you think that you're on a team, to make you think that this is not a pyramid scheme, to make you feel like, hey, we're on the same level. It's just a tool that MLMs use, but you are beneath. So yeah, Salah had a link tree already set up. So I'm just using his for now until I get one. But uh, so that's why you'll see his name. But just message me if you have any questions about it. If you have anything, they do give you a, I think it's 90 day. I'll check for sure and I'll put the, the number here. They have a money. Let's read this. Try it for 90 days. And if it doesn't give results, you can request money back. It is ideal to have a medical exam and keep track of your weight to see the before and after results. Okay. Back guarantee if you're not satisfied with the product and it's not working for you. So really, you know, <laughs> I mean, it can't hurt if it's something you're, you think could benefit you. Another thing I really like is the amount of vitamins in it because I need, I don't take any vitamins. So that for me is something that it also will help with, you know? You didn't tell us the amount of vitamins that are in it, okay? You don't even know the amount of vitamins. If you're going to be reading a vitamin list off of a package, what you need to do, like I said before, is talk about the percentage. If there's 0.000% of vitamin C, is that really, is that supplement going to be good? Is that going to make any difference? No. So I feel really like, <laughs> I still feel a bit of energy from the Unimate, I swear. So um but yeah, uh, I swear, guys, I swear, I swear to Allah, I still feel energy. Bitch, you ain't got you. What? How can you look at? There's the lion face again. <laughs> this is the point. Whenever I pause it, this is at the point where she's thinking, "What else can I say right now to try to convince these idiots that follow me and believe anything that I have to say that I'm being trustworthy right now?" Let me think. She couldn't even write her lies down on a piece of paper. She's the most unorganized. She's. Oh. Um, I, I found the Unimate made me feel very alert and even like Salah had some with me and he was like, he was super hyper. He was running around with a cat. I'm really excited to see how these products make me feel. A lot of people say it's made them feel amazing. The person who, you know, Salah's friend who um, taught us about the products and everything like that. Oh, taught us about the products. Okay. So 
it just so happened that she was looking for a supplement, guys, right? And she came across this supplement uh, because of the packaging and because it offers you, you know, a lifestyle change and she's looking to be happy. And it was just like something drew me to it, guys. And it just so happens that Sala's friends also were drawn to it because they were looking for a better life as well. And so they're a part of my team now who are teaching me basically this bitch got God. That, that's the whole point of this 19 video, this 19 minute video. She went to the seminar, the bitch got got. <laughs> Salah's friends came and played their ass <laughs> and had them pay into an MLM scam. And now she's trying to put y'all at the bottom of the pyramid. You can't make this shit up, girl. Sorry. Not going to happen. Uh, he has been with the company for 10 years and he loves it. it makes him feel great. His whole family uses it. So we'll see. Um, anyway, uh, yeah. So if you want, again, in the description, check out my referral link. And if you do order uh, and you need support with it, and you have any questions, if you're thinking of ordering, just reach out to me on TikTok, and I'll definitely get back to you as soon as possible, okay? So, um, thanks for watching this video, and uh, as the days come, we'll see the results and uh, how it goes. Bye, guys. As how many days come, at what days? What days? Five days? Ten days? 422 days? How is anyone supposed to know that the benefits that you are getting are not coming from your medication? How are you going to prove that it came from the supplement that you're trying to shove down people's throats? Are you, you're not, this is insane what she's doing. She's about to lose her channel. She's definitely about to use her, lose her um, dynamic with this MLM. She's going to end up owing them a bunch of money and not having anyone to sell it to because she won't be able to be a rep because she's already broken the law and it's only been 19 minutes. <laughs> this idiot has already gone online and broken the law by claiming that it's FDA approved. And oh, I want to show you guys something here. She was called out for the fact that it wasn't FDA approved, right? So what does she do? She very calculatively puts a correction on her own um, video, right? In the comment section, she doesn't pin the comments so people can see it at the top, okay? She just writes it 10 hours ago. Well, it was 10 hours when I saw it. So I saw the screenshot at 3 a.m. So that was it, 10 hours before that. Correction to the FDA approval. FDA does not require approval for supplements, but Unicity follows the required FDA guidelines. Here is more info. Now, who is she expecting to click on this link, right? And double check that Unicity is following FDA guidelines just because they say so, because they don't have anyone holding them accountable to follow the guidelines because they're not getting FDA approval. So anybody can put on the website, hey, we're following the guidelines. How the fuck do we know you're following the guidelines if FDA hasn't said, FDA hasn't said you're following the guidelines? Like, and then the audacity of her to just stick this in the middle of her comment section, y'all, didn't even pin it at the top. So if that means that anybody who doesn't choose to scroll through all the idiots on your comment section, right, will think it's FDA approved because you did not remove it from the video and you didn't put anything at the bottom saying, hey, guys, made a mistake. Like, why didn't you edit this video and put this as like a sticker or take out the FDA approval part? You leave it in there and very calculatively and purposely say, in the middle of your comment section like sh she's such a scammer it, and this is where i said you know what nah i'm making a reaction to this this is where she pissed me off because i hate people who break the law and use the law and use manipulation tools and tactics to basically have a profit and she's taking it out on the only people that even support her shit. It's not even like she has a separate channel where she's just gathering people, other people. She has a relationship of some sort with these people. They go on her lives, right? They, they're in her comment section. She's responding. She's talking to them to the camera. And, and still lying to their face and breaking the law and trying to make money off them. It is so foul that I have a personal vendetta against her. So this is video number one when it comes to foodie beauty. Come on back. I'm going to be, um, it's been an hour right now and I'm already sick of her. Like I actually feel nauseous from her bullshit. So I'll be reacting to another video uh, maybe later tonight, tomorrow. I have some work to do. And I'm also going to be going back into history, like I said, to call out this liar for every lie she's ever told. Because the fact that she could sit there, guys, you know, I'm going to be honest with you, like I always have been and try to gaslight everybody has got she's she's actually reminding me of the abusive relationship I got out of. And I had liked this woman and thought that she was the one being abused. I gave her a super chat. I joined her stupid subscription. I was over there sending her Instagram messages. Girl, this is not a good relationship for you. What's happening right now is a cycle of abuse. This is called reaction abuse. This is called uh, toxic love. This da, 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 da. And she is the issue. 
this whole time. She scammed me. No, it's on. So for everyone who was able to stay and watch this whole entire video, I commend you. <laughs> But I did want to just look at the Unicity Balance uh, Ingredients website quickly. I wanted to just read a little portion, which I'm going to add to the screen. Okay, so Unicity Balance Product Information Summary. Unicity Balance is a safe, effective, natural supplement for balancing cholesterol and blood sugar that is clinically proven. It's an easy-to-use drink mix that you take 10 to 15 minutes before you eat. See the chart below for the specifics on how each ingredient contributes to losing weight and balancing cholesterol and blood sugar levels. The only, I'm not even going to going to put the energy into this, but what I do have to say is that clinically proven doesn't mean shit. Because the thing about clinically proven clinically proven trials is that they're biased because they're paid by the person who wants to get the results that they want. Clearly, they're not going to hire doctors that are going to say or whatever clinicians, whatever you want to call them, that's going to say, you know what, your product is shit. Sorry, and then they're going to post that up on the website. Obviously, the person, the doctor who's willing to take the highest bid and give the company what they want is going to be the one that gives the results, right? So it's kind of like when you have a lawsuit or you see a trial and they have one, the evidence is the same for both the defense and for the um, prosecutor, but there could be two experts on either side looking at the same exact evidence coming up with two different results. And obviously the one that is on the prosecutor side will use those results and the results that are for the defendants will use that result, right? It's like clinician doesn't mean shit. What we want to see is FDA approval. Okay, foodie beauty. Okay. And the other thing I wanted to show you guys was a video that I found. Let me just put it on the screen first. So I found this video, Unicity Balance Product Review Scam? Question mark Is Unicity Feel Good a Scam? Does it help with weight loss? And a gentleman named Dr. Allo is um, going to give you the rundown on that. Okay, okay. I'm going to leave the link below also because I don't steal. <laughs> Unicity Product Review. So you see a lot of people on here doing their lives, showing these uh, packets or these teas or these Unicity things. And I'll put a couple pictures of them. Um, but they're talking about, oh, this is great for weight loss. It's a tea. You just drink it every day and you lose a bunch of weight. So um, first of all, that is not true. If that was true, we would be telling everyone to do it. Second of all, I ding, 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 ding. I find it hilarious that Foodie Beauty thinks that she's found the answer to not only asthma, but diabetes and weight loss. If it was possible to have a 100% healthy remedy, right? that you can lose weight, control all of these ailments, why the hell would it not be FDA approved? And why wouldn't everyone be using the method? Come on. I looked up the uh, uh, ingredients and none of it causes weight loss. One of them uh, called balance lowers your cholesterol, but all it is is extra fiber. And if you look at it, it's only three grams of insoluble fiber. And I pulled up their ingredients list. So it would cause your cholesterol to improve in the same way that maybe Cheerios or Metamucil or psyllium or any kind of fiber. <laughs> Y'all foodie beauty got scan like a motherfucker. This is hilarious to me. Fiber uh, may do that. So there's no actual direct cholesterol lowering. It just kind of like you know, reduces some absorption of some things in your gut, if it even contains that, because it's a supplement, it doesn't even have to actually contain that. Um, the next thing you'll notice is most of these people on here doing their lives, showing these packets, hey, get these packets, get these packets, they're great for weight loss. Most of them are obese and or morbidly obese. <laughs> okay. Do you see, do you see? Okay. And so for Foodie Beauty, I guess she can make the claim, hey, I haven't even been on the supplement long enough for me to show that it could work. So that's why I'm morbidly obese. But if that's the case, why the hell are you selling it to other people and telling them to use your affiliate code if you don't know the results? Either way, she's fucked. It doesn't make any sense. It's called, I need money. I'm broke. My views are low. I'm desperate. And you know what? I don't care if I put your health at risk. I don't care if I put my health at risk. As long as I'm making some money to get my ass back home, I'm good. Or who knows what her reasoning is. It could be just sheer greed. Whatever the reason is, she will stoop to the depths of hell in order to get what she wants. And it's, it's ridiculous. And this is why I'm so irritated. So if these packets uh, did so well, why are you still overweight and not, you know, at the goal weight? Unless that is your goal weight and maybe you lost 100 pounds. That's not her goal weight, doctor, and she did not lose 100 pounds. Okay, I'll proceed. I don't know. 
but the vast majority of people that have showed up on my feed so far have been quite uh, overweight. And if you look at when they start talking about it on their lives or in their videos, like, oh, go to this website, put in my name and say that I referred you and you get 15% off or like whatever it might be. And it turns out it's a multi-level marketing scheme to get you to buy these things. And everybody makes a small percentage of it. It's sort of like the TikTok snaps, you know? Exactly. It's all, it always sounds, it's like, Hey, Hey, I'm going to boost this product up to you. And I'm going to tell you, this is the most amazing product and it costs this much money. And you're going to think this product is so good that when I offer you 30% off, you think you're getting a deal, but in actuality, it's a pile of dog shit. So really you're paying 70% of dog shit, not 30% off of a good product. You know, when the TikTok snaps were really popular, um, this is kind of a very, very similar thing. Um, the other thing uh, about this, that it's not really science backed. If you look at the other ingredients that supposedly curb your appetite, you know, as opposed to the cholesterol stuff, it curbs your appetite and causes weight loss. None of those ingredients have been scientifically proven to actually curb your appetite. So hence why the FDA will not approve it because the FDA specifically says that it has to be scientifically proven. There has to be a scientific uh, connection with the ingredients and the results. So because it's not scientific, you can't get FDA approval. So when you say, oh, we're following the FDA guidelines, you how? Because you're not poisoning everybody? No, you're not. You're not following the FDA guidelines because you are saying that a product is going to provide you with significant results and you're acting as if it's scientifically based when it is not. So you are the opposite of following FDA guidelines. Hard pass on this one, people. Don't fall for these kind of gimmicks. Everyone wants a shortcut to weight loss. There are no shortcuts. Let me just break it. You've been doing this for a long time. These kind of things are shortcuts, and there are no shortcuts. Fad diets, short-term weight loss, all this kind of stuff, it, it really doesn't work. you got to put in the work and effort. Grab my free resources or follow me. I talk about weight loss literally all day and all night. Okay. Well, y'all, there it is. So we already knew all of this, but I just thought it would be nice to just actually put in some information that's um, from a doctor. And I'm going to link his video below. Maybe you might want to follow his channel. Hey, Beezers, instead of listening to that idiot, maybe go to an actual doctor, but do not listen to Foodie Beauty peddling MLM in order for her to make money to fly home and pay for her car. Okay. God damn. Anyway, that's all. I'm a, I'm going to go. Like I said, I'm going to be on her ass from now on and <laughs> I'll be coming back with a video for you possibly tomorrow, maybe the next day. Not sure. Take care.